largest economy, Nigeria, celebrates its 60th independence today. To commemorate the day, we interact with some members of the Nigerian community in Ghana to get their views on the socio-economic climate of Nigeria, Nigeria at 60, and what they make of President Buhari's handling of the economy, and more. Come with me. I'm not happy with the situation of the country at 60 or 60 above now. Because the country is not prog progressing. If this, this thing is leading to Muammo, uh, our president, Major General Muhammadu Buhari, he should try to amend his uh, administrator. Because people who are working with him, they are not ready to do anything. If he has good ambition for the country, the people under his cabinet, they don't have any good attention for the country. That's why we youth, majority of us are outside the country. We have an intelligent people outside the country, but they can't come back home because of the situation of the, of the country. No security, no light. That light and the security and unemployment, those three things are the three keys that is making we Nigerian youth coming outside of the country to come and stay outside. With this anniversary that you want to do, you should try to make a change before his tenure will end in 2023 so that we know that we have we elect a better future for Nigeria. But if the situation still continues like this, we, use, we will continue cursing him every day and night. I'm not trying to say that. He may not be there, but he will be hearing it, either spiritually or physical. Nigeria as a country or as an entity, Nigeria is a failed state. Do you understand? Because after, 50, after 60 years, they are going to celebrate 60 years of independence on the 1st of October. But me personally, I call it dependent. You understand? So there are many things wrong over there. You see, I've been in Ghana here for years now. I've seen how things are going on here. You see, no matter how Ghana is bad, Ghana is more, 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 more better than Nigeria. You see, they were saying that Nigeria is a giant of Africa then. But if you ask me, I will tell you that Ghana here is a giant of Africa. You understand? So what can you do for your citizens? What can we benefit the common citizens in the streets? That's what we can benefit. But in Nigeria, what are they celebrating? What? No development, no good. If you are, if you are flying from Ghana here to Lagos night, you are, landing, you are landing at Lagos in the night. When you are coming down, it will be like you are going to hellfire. You are coming to hellfire. You understand? So nothing to celebrate. It's good. It's, it's something we have to celebrate. But talk of uh, 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 what our leader is doing is not, it's not good in the way that the things they're supposed to do as a leader in a, in a great country like Nigeria, they are not doing it. So, but we cannot say we, know, we will not celebrate independence. We will celebrate it because we will be celebrating it for a while. Oh, I'm happy that we are celebrating 60 years independence. 60 years. It's not easy. But we are lacking behind. At least we're supposed to be now, you know, we're supposed to go far. Where we are now is not where we're supposed to be. You know, Dubai just discovered oil that of I mean some few years back. But look at where they are today. So we are lacking behind. I think our government should do something about it so that we can have a better place. You have heard from some Nigerian citizens on the social economic state of the country 60 years on. Happy Independence Day to Nigeria. My name is Babrai Sinamboni for my Nigeria. <laughs> <laughs>